Hello everyone, my name is Wamid Abdurrahman and today I'm going to demonstrate to you how to install EGS system on um, uh, an Ubuntu uh, Linux version 20.04. Uh, the installation process I believe is going to be uh, similar if you decide or if you're using an earlier version of uh, Ubuntu. First thing we will do, we will uh, we'll update uh, our uh, uh, Ubuntu. Uh, we will open terminal. Terminal, okay. So we have a shell and we will type sudo apt uh, upgrade, uh, update first. We'll update the packages. Update, okay. It will ask me for uh, password next step is we will will repeat the last command but with an upgrade and yes so now we will start by installing uh, the uh, prerequisite packages uh, that includes uh, Fortran, uh, uh, compiler C, uh, compiler and C++ compilers, and the make package. Uh, probably the C compiler and the C++ compilers are already installed, uh, but we will check that. So what we'll do is we'll issue the command sudo apt, and now install. And uh, the, the Fortran uh, compiler package is the uh, G Fortran, Fortran, okay, and hit uh, G Fortran. So probably had a mistype a typo there, okay, and yes, okay. So the next is we will uh, uh, install the C compiler. Uh, probably this is already installed. So we'll check. Yes, it's already installed. Probably the 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 C plus plus, which is G plus plus package, probably installed, and the make package. We want that also, okay that's also installed so these are the four packages that are essential for uh, running uh, EGS NRC in your uh, in Linux there are additional or optional packages that we're also going to install because they're important for the GUI to work and uh, 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 the grace package for plotting uh, so the first one we will install is the tcl package so tc uh, tcl and then another package i can actually add a name of the second package which is tcl and i can put dash y uh, minus y it's an option uh, so that the the computer will not uh, prompt me uh, that yes uh, i would like to install this package or not so when I do that, I don't get the prompt. And now it's immediately just downloading the packages and going to install them. OK, so we will also we need to install the, the uh, Qt, Qt5 default. OK, uh, that's and the Qt5 uh, QMake. make package and we'll add the minus y there so it's installing them the next thing we're going to install is the the grace uh, grace package uh, 
grays that's for plotting okay we will need another package uh, the motif so it's uh, going to be lib motif and this is div okay and finally we will need the at uh, package that's for allowing us to do parallel to launch things parallel process uh, para use parallel processing on linux okay so uh, we're done then the next thing is we need to uh, download the uh, uh, configuration uh, application uh, so I'll open the browser egsnrc search for that it should take me okay. we'll go to their github pages and uh, there is an instructions install installation instructions uh, and then on Linux so the packages so everything that I've done so far are these nine uh, packages we have installed them uh, what we need to do next is to install to, to uh, we need to install the git application uh, so that is not there in order to start to, to clone and download the EJS system so we will also again uh, install git Okay, git is installed. Now we can clone the uh, X, uh, EGS NRC uh, from GitHub to our computer. Uh, we will issue the command. Uh, so the, the, the command is here actually, git. We'll just copy this. and run remember i'm in the home directory and we uh, would expect now that uh, a a folder will be created with the egs nrc called egs nrc and under it we will have hen house and all the packages uh, for egs while this is happening we can go to the next step because we need to download another file uh, the other file is the configuration file and we can actually download it we will go to the uh, to this page and uh, we're going to pick up this this file the EGS NRC configuration Linux so I'll just click on it and yes I want to save the file so it's saving the file now So EGS and RC uh, finished cloning in uh, my system. We'll check if the other uh, file got downloaded. Yes, completed. Okay. The next step is we need to go to the download folder. So CD downloads. And we will find that the file that we have downloaded, the configuration file Linux is there. We need to change the permission uh, to an executable file and we do that by issuing the following command cmod change mode plus x means make it uh, executable and we just type in the file name there it is if i do ls again you will see that the file uh, now beca became executable it has the x whereas before that uh, it did not have an x there now we will just launch this file so i'll put dot slash and egs nrc that will launch uh, the file 
with a nice uh, graphical user interface for the configuration so just hit on next and we will define first where is the location of our uh, hen house package that is usually going to be uh, under your home area or in the directory where you have actually cloned the AGS NRC system so I know I've cloned it under my uh, home area so it's, uh, we're going to select it and there is hen house we're going to select that now the working area is uh, sometimes uh, defined as EGS home we can make it the same as uh, our uh, uh, clone directory but you know a lot of people would recommend to actually make it separate uh, so probably we'll do that so I'm gonna hit here I'm in there and then uh, I can just create a directory I'm call, gonna call that directory EGS underscore home so that directory will contain uh, the simulations that we will be running our user codes uh, so we'll copy some stuff from the or the system will do it for us it will copy some of the user codes from the hen house directory into the home directory for uh, uh, for the user so i'm going to select that typical that's fine next yes so uh, existing yes okay and then hit next again okay and then we need to click on set environment and as well as to uh, create uh, shortcuts on the desktop and we click on install now it's going to install uh, EGS uh, NRC on our system and we will wait it will take some time I'll type bash first so it loads the uh, environments uh, correctly and then if I start typing EGS uh, and then tab you see there are these are applications that I could run so EGS GUI there it is so, so I have demonstrated to you how to install EGS NRC on uh, Ubuntu Linux please share uh, this video with uh, your colleagues who are interested in doing this uh, running EGS on, on Ubuntu Linux and uh, subscribe to the channel I will be posting more videos on EGS uh, and how to use it on, on Linux especially uh, how to use the command line and, and, and launch the applications from, from shell